welcome back to another episode with me, Bellfire, and today we are back in Space Engineers. And I want to do a little bit of work. So, just an update before I do anything. I had to remove the whole winch system because I really wanted it to work. But unfortunately, I don't think it's going to, just simply due to how uh, space does not like zero gravity. Or the winch does not like zero gravity. So that's why I had to get rid of the winch. I might add something else here. I'm not sure yet. I most likely will, once I figure out what I'm adding. But I don't know exactly what yet. Okay. So now... What I should work on... First, I want to... I need to check the center of gravity because... Oh boy. So, which one is center of gravity again? Or mass, sorry. Center of mass is... Purple. Okay. And that's not the one. I want this one. Yep. Okay, so it needs to be moved forward by a couple of blocks. Got it. Oh, yeah, that's right. I need steel plates. Okay. So now let me head up and over here. Into this area right here. Hmm. Okay, so... Here, I don't know what I want to do yet, but... Mm, I mean, the ship's going to need defenses. I know that much. So... Instead of just having it be this part, why not? Go with a good majority of the inside. Like to right here. Okay. Then over this way. Yep. And now I can go up top and start painting. Okay. Also, I'm sorry about this video coming out late. I've just had 
I've been having to do stuff with, or, I, yeah, I've been having to deal with life, basically. And it's been a lot, so the, I did not record yesterday, which was Monday, so I'm recording twice today, which is Tuesday of this week. And my plan is either to upload both videos today, or one video today, one video tomorrow morning. I'm not sure what I'm going to do yet, but I guess it'll be known as soon as I'm done. As for this, though, I, I might have an idea on how I want it to look, but I don't know if it'll work. Especially considering uh, my weapon constraint. I can only use energy weapons. So I'm going to need to figure out what weapon I can use with the turret control blocks in order to make a weapon that will fit in this area. Hmm. I mean, this is a pretty big area for a weapon. So, I'm going to go fly into the garage to see what weapons I have access to. And also, I'm pretty sure I'm going to need much bigger thrusters, which... I'll figure out when I get, that, get to that point. Okay. And I left the garage up. Great. Or the elevator up. I mean, I am glad I made this drop hole over here. So, okay, here we are. Here are all of the weapons that I think I have access to. So there are a few gimbal rate lasers. Uh, mounted lasers, disco ball looking ones. These th these all here are mounted lasers, I think. This is a mounted one. This is a beam cannon that's facing backwards. Uh, power drain distance of 3,000 meters. This is a fixed T3 laser that I'm assuming shoots out of here. Smart firing must be manually aimed. Will not target projectiles. Roll battle. Ammo energy range 100% to... Oh, range with 100% damage to 1,000 meters. And at 2,500 meters, it's 50% damage. Uh, 8 kilometer range. 5,000 damage per second. Fixed laser naked, then this is the fixed laser. Couple armor pieces. The obelisk. A few mounted turrets. A PGI-X beam cannon. What's this little thing? Point defense turret and a plasma accelerator cannon. So my thought process is get all of the ones that I might use onto a bar. Oh. So I'm not going to use the gimbal laser. I'm not using this laser turret. I want to test this because... This one seems interesting, and I want to use this for, like, maybe a broadside or something. So, okay. Um, I'm thinking the laser cannon, the beam cannon, and maybe the T3. So... I need a... 
Laser cannon. Oh, there are two of them. Bonus versus armor, reduction versus shields, whereas this one is... Um, bonus versus armor, reduction versus shields. This is 30,000 DPS over, over 60,000 before overheating. 8 kilometer range again, whereas this one is just flat 5,000. Okay. Then I want the beam cannon. Um, okay. Then I want to keep the drill launch bay. I want to keep the plasma accelerator. Fix T3. There is a T1 and T2, I think. So there's this T3 laser. T2, T2. Okay, I fixed 50 millimeter. This is a Gatling cannon. This is a plasma cannon. Mm, heavy plasma cannon. This one sounds interesting. It's a small grade? That's interesting. But, uh, no thank you. Um. Okay. Plasma repeater. Oh, well. Hmm. This is a Star Wars and partial. Okay. So I want the plasma repeater since this looks like it's a fixed block. And I will also take this one just so I can test all of these. Why can't I place it? MK2C. Oh, construction components. Okay, so I need a combination of different materials. Got it. Now, where's my... Where's that hole? Ah, there it is. Okay, well... I guess I'll be able to test all of these. See how well... Well, no, not how well, just how all of these w work, I guess. And I mean, some of them are really big. Hmm. But this thing is the smallest one of them by far. Okay. So I'm thinking... Line them all up. Starting with the ones I can place, then going on to the ones I can't because construction components. So I can place that one. I can place this one. Which needs to be like that. Can I place this one? I can. Okay. So now here's the fun bit of figuring out which way it goes. I'm pretty sure it goes this way. Then number six. Oh my... Oh my lord, that is a... That is so big! Okay. Let me go ahead and now grab some construction components. Uh, 
Okay. Now, let me place all the ones I could not place before. There's one of them. This is the MK2A, so then what? MK2C. Wow. I am surprised with how big those are. And why are you... Flag, ship build and repair system, ignore, weld function, use grind color, yep. Generator to disable and hack. Actually, hack only. Actually, no, n neither. Okay. Push components immediately. There we go. That should speed up their salvaging speed. Oh my. So some of them require thruster components. Superconductors, that's to be expected. The plasma accelerator. Um, a retractable plasma cannon capable of accelerating plasma to 2,000 meters a second with an effective di distance of 2 kilometers. And travel distance of 3. Neat. And then the EX-1 beam cannon, power drain, 120. I don't know what. Hmm. MWI Universal Energy. Okay. Flagship. I want these things welded, so... I need to make help others is on. Okay. So which one's getting worked on first? They all are. Really, you need your... Th you need your thruster components. You also need your thruster components. Along with you. Superconductors. Superconductors. Okay. Well, I know where pretty much all of that is going. Not flagship. I want assembler number. What? What was it? Two? Two. Yep, there are all my power cells and thruster components. Or superconductors, not thruster components. My question is where are all the thruster components? Ah, uh, man. Okay, well, it looks like I'm canceling out uh, battery or power cells now. Did I do it again? I did it again. Did it again. Great. Oh my. Now, there we 
go. Yeah, this is probably the least fun part about having a quota. I mean, hey, at least it's going by ever so slightly. Okay, and I think one last one. But my question is, don't I have thruster components in a quota? Yeah, I do. So then how come... Maybe I just didn't give it enough time. Okay. So, mostly superconductors. Okay, an assembler two here. Well, that, this was completely pointless to do. And then this one all the way on the end needed these. Oh my. And now the other fun p Wait. I can just do what I did again. Just this time with all the power cells. Oh my. Why am I fully ready for this thing to blow up part of the hole when I fire it? Mode. Mouse control. Toggle. Key fire. Oh, I can choose the color. Neat. Uh, weapon group ID, target lead, color, terminal, advanced features. <laughs> oh my. What? Oh my. How much damage did that do? I don't think it did much. I'm still curious though. Plus that, me doing this gives everything a char chance to uh, charge. Or at least gives that a chance to sh charge. And I don't 
Well, that's because I'm too low. Yeah, I don't see where it hit. Okay. Maybe it doesn't deal much damage against terrain. I mean, that's entirely possible. Oh, and I'm almost out of hydrogen. Oh, no. Yeah, that's definitely not intimidating, flying towards that. There we go. That sounds so weird to me. And it doesn't look like it deforms the terrain when it hits, which is interesting to say the least. Okay. Well, now I want all of the superconductors. So that'll be this one done. That one started. Still, I need more? Wow. Just simply because I, for whatever reason, need more. Well, I mean, it makes sense. They're all laser weapons. Weapons. Uh, makes sense as to why I need so uh, many um, superconductors. That's it. Alrighty. Okay. I will go ahead. Wait. Oh yeah, superconduct superconductors. I do need those. And a lot of them. Okay. I did not mean to do that. Oh, some of the other assemblers have taken over. Nice. Ah, there we go. I still think I need more. Oh, hey, well, I can take from this one. Never mind. Okay, let me hear this one. So this one is a constant laser. That one is more of a plasma bolt. And now this one... That's cute. Hmm. Key toggle, key fire. I wonder what those advanced features are.
And also, I will... Oh, wait. That's right. I'm, I'm just turning all these on. Just to make th it a little bit easier. Okay, well, anyway, I hope you all enjoyed the video. Please don't forget to leave a like, comment, subscribe, share, all that amazing stuff, and I will see all of you in the next episode. Bye, guys. Thank <laughs> you.